Hey there, welcome back. As I mentioned in the last video, if you are diligent and open-minded, you will most likely see an improvement in your happiness levels. And as I also mentioned in the last video, to help you assess whether your happiness levels are improving, we are going to measure it through self-reports. So let's get to that now. I'm going to use something called the Subjective Wellbeing Scale, developed by the one and only Dr. Happiness. Professor Ed Diener and his colleagues to measure your happiness levels. This scale has been used by several researchers and has been validated as a reliable one. Uh, this paper in which it was published has been cited over 10,000 times. With that, let's move on to discussing the seven deadly happiness sins and why they deflate happiness levels and the seven habits of the highly happy and why they enhance happiness levels. Bye and see you soon. <laughs>